Skirt steak. Skirt steak. You ever had skirt steak? Today we're making skirt steak, and we're gonna uh, we're gonna. Do, I don't even know what to do right now. I'm blanking. Hey, I'm Eric from Grill Slingers. Today we're making skirt steak. That. All right, so like um, someone said earlier, uh, today we're doing skirt steak. Now, uh, a little bit about skirt steak. If you are looking to buy a skirt steak, hopefully it's labeled properly, uh, you're gonna find two kinds. You're gonna find an outside skirt and an inside skirt. Uh, the difference between the two is the inside skirt's a lot larger, um, has more surface area, and not as tender as the outside skirt. They do that right? Inside, not as tender. Outside, more tender. I looked it up on Google like five seconds ago. But with the outside skirt, it also is a much smaller cut. If you're used to having traditional carne asada, that's gonna be like the inside skirt or like a flank. Did I get that right again? Whereas the inside, or I'm sorry, the outside skirt, much smaller cut, but extremely tender. There is a ton of intramuscular fat here. You'll see these long strands of muscle. Um, these don't have to be marinated like um, an inside skirt is. You can just season these and you can throw them straight on the grill. Um, you can do really whatever you want. You can serve it as a traditional steak. Um, and that's kind of what we're gonna do here today. But one of the classic combinations with the skirt steak is chimichurri. Now, we could just cook this traditional and you know dip it in chimichurri, but I was thinking, why don't we season it with chimichurri and see how that goes from there. All right, so we found some chimichurri seasoning. And yes, uh, while I was getting the beef ribs that I'm not sure if it already came out yet or it's coming out um, from Wild Fork, we grabbed some chimichurri seasoning. This is basically all the dry components that go into chimichurri, uh, minus the red wine vinegar and olive oil. So we're actually going to do those things on our skirt steak first. So I've got some red wine vinegar that we're going to kind of drippy drip on here. Now we're gonna put a little bit of olive oil on there, just also to help the kind of seasoning stick a little better. Oh, maybe a lot of olive oil. And then we're gonna use our chimichurri seasoning. And we're gonna coat this guy. Now skirt stays good for like tacos, you can do burritos, you can do just traditional steak out of it. Fajitas is also a great idea. Anything where you're, you're chopping it up against the grain now, if you're asking yourself what's in the chimichurri, let me tell you. All right, sea salt, granulated garlic, whole parsley, minced garlic, green onion, cilantro, chili flakes, oregano, and a little bit of ground cumin. This is all ready to go. So we're gonna go ahead, we actually have our smoker running already. Um, we're gonna get this on our grill. Preferably, you wanna start low, uh, somewhere in the 250 to 300 range, so that way you can kinda just gently warm up, and then you wanna finish with a hard sear or a hard grill. So. We're gonna get these on, and we're gonna see how it goes. So our skirt steaks are done. Um, every fly out here in the universe is trying to get in on this. Uh, I'm gonna make a little bit of chimichurri to go on the side. The secret here for cutting the skirt steak, again, you've got the fibers going this way. So you wanna cut against the grain here. So let's start with this guy right here. So a cross section, we're, we're at about a medium well to well done. Uh, again, this stuff's so tender that it doesn't really matter. Uh, I'm gonna do a little dip here in the chimney. Let's go in for a bite. Stupidly tender. Really rich beef flavor. Let's do one without the dip. Falls apart. Super delicious, super fast. You want a bite? Were you looking for Sasquatch or just dressed like you're looking for him? Oh, no, so you can't see me when I'm coming. Feel a little scrub of that. This is Richie, by the way. Wow. What do you I'm think? Impressed. It doesn't just look good, it tastes good too. There you go. Again, if you want to see this recipe, click the link in the description. While you're at it, make sure you drop a comment, like, subscribe. Skirt Steak's delicious. And we'll see you next time. You didn't even give me the sauce, dude. You don't need the sauce. Oh, sauce is awesome.